Hey, welcome back everybody. Here's the really cool thing about fishing rivers is that you're going to be fishing the most obvious stuff out there. The logs, stumps, laydowns, the stuff that you can actually see with your naked eyes, the stuff where the fish typically are. There's fish right there, right there, right there. Got it, got it. There we go. All right. This big daddy. Calm down. Calm down, feller. Any day. Got him. All right. How about that? Wow. Well, that's what happens. You fish on these rivers and you pitch up their shallow. I want to show you folks something. First of all, I want to show you that bass. That's just a good quality bass for you right there. Beautiful, long, skinny, native fish. That's not a Florida strain right there. That's just a pure Texas strain fish. Big mouth, long, skinny body. Just a fantastic fish for you right there. We're going to let that fish go back. And I want to make a major point to you about river fishing. It's what I've learned over my career fishing for bass, I'm way back here in a very shallow spot. In fact, look here behind me. My trolling motor is kicking up mud. I'm so shallow. I, I'm no more than two feet of water back in here. And these fish will migrate back in the shallow water. That's just where they live. So we talked about how easy river fishing is, but it's, it's shallow and it's shoreline, basically. You just go down the shoreline this is a little pocket that comes off the shoreline. You fish everything in that little pocket, every little stick up, every stump, every bush, every reed, cattail, everything you see could hold a fish, even if it's in that shallow water. And it really doesn't matter what time of the year it is. They'll get shallow and stay shallow. Cold winter, hot summer, it's just where they live. Remember that whatever river system you fish on, they live shallower in rivers than they do in lakes or reservoirs.